Uh, what's your favorite place? Also, Evan. Yeah, that was the day I was talking too much. But okay. Favorite place. I, what's your favorite place in the world, Zan? Wow. Wow. Let me think. I've been. Wow. You know what I would like to say? I haven't been there yet, but <laughs> the, the places I have been, okay. Oh, my gosh. Hmm. Two places. That, that, no, there is the one that, that edges the other one out. And, okay, here we go. So far, my favorite place, and I've been in a lot of places. Okay, Philippines. That's my number one place. Wow, have you been there? Oh, many times. I love the Philippines. Oh, wow, okay. Philippines. I got friends, I got friends who live there. That's an unexpected answer. Yeah, that's my favorite. And it's so hard because I've been to Japan. And I, I want to say Japan. I want to say Malaysia. I love Malaysia too. I want to say, but anyways, it's Philippines. It's all the Asian countries, huh? Well, you know what? It's it's even Indonesia. Even that's still Asia. Uh, Thailand. I, I like. I love the uh, not so much that the, the Buddhists and all that, but it's just the the energy and and the peacefulness that's there. And also, you get to visit all the the different temples and everything else. All right. And, and and I don't know. They treat me. They treat me extremely well there. All right. So yeah, that, that I, based on as I answered today, that would be my. If I had to pick one, that would be my favorite place. All right. And mainly because of the people. The people are so amazing. But it's so freaking beautiful there too. I mean, there's poverty there. Poverty there also. But um, but it's 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 beautiful. Oh gosh. I, I, I want to say Brazil, too, because Brazil was so beautiful. Okay, I have to pick one. God. Philippines. You already said it. Oh, yeah, I would have to say the Philippines. Philippines. Oh, yeah. yeah. All right. Yeah. The cool. Philippines. Um, I, don't, I don't have one. I mean, wherever you Nina is. You got to pick one. Where, wherever Nina is. Oh, look at that. That's romantic. You see that? <laughs> That is so. Maybe I hope you watch this and see this. That's so see, romantic. Don't need to slow the music down to one to the one point oh, oh that's then. so romantic. He said, "Well, Evan, oh, like that's so." But cool. but it's also like it's true. I mean, I love Toronto. Um, I think it's the greatest thing in the world. Be, but it has to be outside of Canada. It can't be Canada. It has to be outside of Canada where you travel to. Yeah, I mean, I don't, I don't know, I don't care. There's no one that's like, oh my gosh, I wish I could go back to here or. I wish I could go there for the first time. It's it's still just the people, but for, yeah. not the people like in general. The people, uh, the culture. I love the you know yeah. It's it's it's, it's yeah. It's for me. It's a specific people, right? It's like if uh, you go to Vegas and you'll meet. Well, most people in Vegas like, aren't the local people in Vegas, but um, you know, if I go to Vegas and have a great time and meet Zan, you know, it's like I love Vegas. Why? Well, because Zan, right? That it's really just when I go and visit. God, you don't know, but my life before Nina, when I would visit a city, I would see nothing. I would oh. be, I would be in coffee shops, just meeting Believe Nation. Like, okay, I'm here in Texas. Who wants to meet up? What are we doing? I got, I got a day and a half. I want to. Get as many sessions in as possible. I'd be in hotel rooms and coffee shops. Like, I wouldn't see anything. So, Nina helped you become more, like, social and explore more in that whatever city you guys went to. Uh, no, I'm still not social. I, I don't want to do that stuff. I do it for her. Like, we do it together. Right, right. So, if we travel, we, together, we would have some time to go and look at try whatever the local food is and and see the local sites and whatever but it just me if i travel by myself i'm 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 doing no restaurants like whatever the closest thing is i'll eat a bag of almonds for dinner dude like i don't care get me back out onto the floor <laughs> what's what i'm here for <laughs> no tourism no sites that just people it's just the people that's all it's all yeah. i care about so that yeah. could be anywhere. Like I'm just inside hotel rooms and coffee shops the whole time. Now that's that's weird. I mean, I'm not, I'm not saying that that's what people should do, but that's that's me. No, I, there's some people like for me. And the reason why I say the Philippines is is it's what you say about the people, the experience, the culture. Every single time I've gone there, they treated me like gold. 
and I love it. You know, it just it make I it's one of those it's one of those places that and there's a handful of places, maybe about five or six, that I don't want to leave, but you have to leave to go back to the United States. But it's like, wow, I can actually live here. Like when I went to Ohio and I met Jason with a Y. Right? Oh yeah, yeah, it's Jason. Like, that's awesome. I don't care about the people in general. That's not what I pay attention to. It's like this the specifics. Like the individual people that I met. Makes a big difference. Yeah, and just That's it, man. That's that's my Oh, this is a good one for you. Something on video wants to know what are the similarities between Canadians and Russians? You know, if there are any. Canadians and Russians? Um Yeah, the similarities between Canadians and Russians. Well, I mean, understand first that Canadian culture is a mix of everything, right? We don't have that strong a culture because everybody's born somewhere else for the most part. I didn't know that. Okay. Yeah, I mean, we have some, but it's not as it's definitely not as strong as 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 Russian culture or American culture, just because we haven't. Um, we we initially came from you know British rule, but we didn't we didn't have the revolution. We had an evolution. Um. Yeah, and just uh, so many people are from somewhere else. We've just we're a mix of all sorts of different cultures smushed into one, which I think is great. Um. I think it's fantastic. Not everybody agrees with that, but I'm I'm a fan. Well, I know what they have in common. Um, they, um, they, they both get a lot of snow, and they like cold weather. <laughs> well, that's that's geography. Yes, I mean we yeah we get a lot of cold. We get a lot of snow. There's snow outside right now. It is cold. I don't know. Canada. I don't know that we like the cold. Uh, I don't think most Canadians like the cold. I like, can't wait for the cold to come. I don't know. I don't know. They 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 celebrate. I know the ice house isn't up there, but they 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 like to be in the snow a lot. Wow, but most people don't live like most people live in Toronto, big cities, right? I mean, it's like it's like you're in New York. It's and New York is cold. Well, it's Chicago. the same. It's yeah, it's the same as Chicago, dude. It's the same as Chicago. Now we think in America, we think of Canadians. We we think you got we think of you guys as almost Americans, like cousins. We we don't we we kind of don't separate Canadians from 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 the U.S. We just think we're all like one, like one we're brother and sister. Family. Say again. One big happy family. Yeah, yeah. We're like we're like brothers and sisters. We don't look at Canadians, you know. I'm being respectful to Russia, but we don't look at we look at Canadians as part of the family, but we don't see Russia that way. <laughs> well, you have a history with Russia too, right? I mean, yeah, a serious history with Russia, <laughs> even but, today. But I think the U.S. has a much stronger identity than than Canada, um, for better or for worse. We, lo we love Canadians. We love 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 Canadians. Yeah, I mean, probably if anything, that's probably it. Is just Internationally, I think we'd be known as just nice people. <laughs> yes. Which is known as being nice, uh, which is not that bad a thing, you know. It's, of, yeah, of all the I, things if I, get... would, if I would ever relocate, I mean, which I probably never will, but if I ever would relocate, it, it probably would be in, it, would, it probably would be in Canada because it's right there. But it's just I just can't deal with the cold weather. It just gets too cold in Canada for me. Why they, that's why they have uh, nine volt battery socks. Is that nine right? volt battery socks? Yeah, I had a I had a I had a buddy in marching band who uh, took a trip up to up to Canada and bought a pair of socks that have like a little pocket in them. Oh my gosh! With wires where you put oh a nine volt gosh. battery that okay. warms up that, the socks. That's like. <laughs> A tourist thing. That's that, that. That's not something we do. No, I, I'm pretty sure that's a very common thing in Winnipeg. Uh, in Winnipeg, Winnipeg, I don't wow. know. But but Winnipeg is not representative of the country. I'm aware. But it's, it's, it's like saying, hey, Rhode Island is 
is United States of America. Oh, uh, <laughs> Ooh, that's such a, ooh, you can't say that. It's so small. Well, that's Winnipeg. <laughs> but Winnipeg is a part of a, a greater province, yeah? No. Most people in Canada are what so so Toronto, Ontario, Ontario is the yeah. biggest. Then uh, actually I actually don't know between British Columbia and uh and Well that's the Quebec. largest city in Toronto, I, right? Isn't Toronto the largest city in Canada? Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's the first place I ever been when I when I went to Canada when I was seventeen years old, that's the first place I went was Toronto. Toronto's almost ten percent of the country. Yeah. Well, to be honest, that's the only place I've been in Canada, it's Toronto. <laughs> I've only been to Canada like maybe three or four times, but every time we go to Toronto, that's it. <laughs> okay, what's next? Okay. Um, Win so, Winnipeg is like Idaho for us. Maybe not Rhode Idaho, Island, but, but yeah. Idaho. What, what about Saskatchewan? Saskatchewan? Yeah. It, it's, a, it's, oh, a, it's, along, it's along the same, like... Uh, axes is yeah. like Calgary. It's like Minnesota. That's what it is. It's Minnesota. It's just as cold. Uh, Minnesota gets real cold. It's Minnesota. Like, it's probably worse than Minnesota. But that they that's the equivalent. Snow like, ever. if you went to Minnesota and you said, "Wow, I went to America," it's okay. Well, you went to one place. Oh yeah, I mean, but well, wasn't Canada back in the day? Wasn't Canada considered the New France? Uh, Quebec. So we, we, we have, um, so French is our second language. We, we do have a French, like a, a, a big French tradition, but not in this province, just in one province. Okay. It's like, just like saying, um, you know, Miami is, isn't it the new Havana or whatever, right? I mean, it's, yeah. It doesn't mean that the whole country is. Right, right, right. Right. They do got a little Havana down there, Miami. A little Cuba. 